Facing the can't connect to this network, error on Windows 10 or 11. This frustrating issue pops up more often than you might think. And today, I'm diving straight into how to fix it. Let's get your connection up and running smoothly again. Before diving into more complex troubleshooting steps, let's start with a simple tip that might just solve your problem right away. First, take a moment to write down your Wi-Fi password on Windows Sticky Notes or any place where you can easily copy it. This way, you can avoid any typos that often occur when typing it out manually. Once you've got your password copied, click on the Wi-Fi icon in the notification area, select the network you're having issues with, and when prompted for a password, simply press Ctrl plus V to paste the copied password. Hit connect immediately after. This can often bypass the error, as incorrect password entries are a common culprit. Let's see if this quick fix gets you connected. Moving on to a more specific solution, let's manage your Wi-Fi settings. Go to the network settings on your device, and from there, find and click on Manage Known Networks. Locate the network that's causing trouble and select Forget. This action erases any saved details that might be incorrect. After doing this, reconnect to the network by entering your Wi-Fi password again. This fresh start can often clear up any connection issues you were experiencing. If you're still having trouble connecting, let's try resetting the network adapter. Head over to change adapter options in your network settings. Right-click on your Wi-Fi adapter, choose Disable, then enable it again to reset the connection. If this doesn't work, you might need a full network reset. Just click Reset Now and confirm by clicking Yes to reboot your system and clear any network configurations that could be causing issues. Next, let's check your IP and DNS settings. Go to the properties of Internet Protocol version 4, TCP slash IPv4, in your network connection settings. Make sure it's set to obtain an IP address and DNS server address automatically. If problems persist, open command prompt as an administrator and run the following commands. Netch Winsock reset, Netch and IP reset resetlog.txt, and IP protocol configuration slash flushes. This will reset your IP settings and clear the DNS cache, which can often resolve network issues. Another effective method is updating your network driver. Open Device Manager, find network adapters, and right-click on your Wi-Fi adapter. Select Update Driver, then choose Browse My Computer for Driver Software. Pick an appropriate driver from the list and follow the prompts to install. If updating doesn't fix the issue, consider reinstalling the network adapter. Back in Device Manager, right-click the adapter and select Uninstall Device. Make sure to check the option to delete the driver software for this device. After uninstalling, restart your computer. Windows should automatically reinstall the driver upon reboot, potentially clearing up the connection problem. Don't forget to use the Windows Network Troubleshooter if you're still facing issues. Access it via network settings and follow the on-screen instructions. It can often automatically find and fix problems. A few additional tips. Ensure your router is working correctly by trying to connect with other devices. Also, check for any pending Windows updates, as these may include important fixes for network-related issues. That's it for this video on troubleshooting the can't connect to this network, error in Windows 1011. I hope these methods help you solve any Wi-Fi connectivity issues you're experiencing. If you found this guide useful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe for more practical tech solutions. Have any questions, or did any of these steps work for you? Drop a comment below, I'd love to hear about your experience. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.